Good morning guys, good morning from Lake Windermere, England's largest lake. Check out this. We've got the paddle board and the dry bag. Amazing. What a lovely Saturday to wake up to. Boys are still at the campsite. I haven't been in yet. It's pretty cold. Not freezing, but pretty cold. So yeah, last night I was chucking it down with rain. Managed to keep everything dry. The thing about being outdoors is you need to make sure everything is dry that needs to be dry. Because you don't want to be wet all weekend so we came friday night and we're gonna stay saturday night as well head back sunday we are camping we are camping over there i don't know where the boys are came with three mates i'm just on my own So yeah, that's us from Lake Windermere. We're gonna close off the night, uh, have a little barbecue once we get back. And um, yeah, we've got half a day here tomorrow to get ourselves out on the lake and enjoy the view. Morning guys, it's Sunday, seven o'clock in the morning and I've just headed out to go find Ray Castle. Now, Ray Castle is about a mile away. So it's quite a nice morning walk. There's no rain, it's not too chilly. So I'm gonna head up there and have a little look. I can actually see, excuse my bed head a bit all over the place I can actually see Ray Castle in the distance I don't know if you can see it just up there so we've walked half a mile and we've got half a mile left lovely little stream crossing the river here yeah out in the wilderness as they say lots of little bunnies running around and they don't seem to be too scared of you either, they just hop by you. So yeah, going home today, two o'clock. But for now, we'll get out to that castle and maybe send the drone up. Oh, looks like they're cuddled up for the night.
absolutely amazing. So, one of the original founders of the National Trust was originally a vicar at Ray Castle, 1985, I do believe. Um, and he moved into the, to work in the castle around that year and was worried about the local effect from tourism and development on, say, the local beauty. And he, and I believe three others, created the National Trust to protect local beauty spots like that. Like, the lakes is part of the National Trust. Um, and yeah, funny enough, I just saw a vicar go into Ray Castle. So, it's obviously still vicars working there. Um, yeah, I didn't associate castles with vicars, but maybe after the castles were not used for what they were originally used for, they may have been turned into churches, I guess. Um, but yeah, magnificent. So if you're new to the countryside, it's always worth remembering, always close gates. Whichever gate you come through, you close it. If you open it, you close it. I guess if it's already open, you should close it as well. Because there's a lot of cattle and sheep grazing. You don't want them to wander because it's a nightmare for the farmer trying to collect all his sheep. Yeah. The uh, the countryside code, as they call it. I just noticed these tracks. I'm not exactly sure what that one is or these triangle ones. Now we have a problem because I need to get through there. Yep, I definitely need to get through there. Now we could take our boots off. It's a little bit of minging. Um, but the lads have got breakfast on, so there's no way I'm going back two miles and missing a bacon butty. Um, yeah, it's a shame really, because it's literally just a little bit, but we're about to get in the lake anyway, so it's not like it's a massive deal. I'll tell you what, though, it's bloody cold. views though right we've finished the lakes we're in the in the village now in the town not the village and then we're gonna shoot home we're gonna shoot home after that don't need pubs Beautiful little town. So I think that concludes our episode of the Lake District, Windermere. Um, yeah, one thing I can say about the town, it's got quite narrow paths. Uh, I can imagine it being very busy in the summer. I mean, we're in October and we're uh, squeezing past on the path. Apart from that, it's um, been beautiful. So many shops in the town. Get your little knickknacks. Spend all day here. Anyway, we'll leave it there. Hope you enjoyed. See ya.